I created Metcom 20 years ago due to my interest and passion for interconnecting machines, computers and people. And I've always had a deep passion for technology. I remember at the age of four or five years old, I was fascinated by the idea of how you could turn a light on from a meter away. At the age of 16, I built one of the first computers in South Africa. I really enjoyed experimenting with the programming and connections between lights and switches and motors and controlling things. And all that laid a very strong foundation for many companies I started until I finally created Metacom with the intention of interconnecting machines, computers and people in a way that seamlessly integrates processing and technology around us and to make the world an easier and a better place to live in. That is in our DNA, is the interconnectedness and reliable point-to-point -point connection between systems. Over time, we have entered into multiple vertical markets, such as multimedia, streaming radio, Wi-Fi hotspots, services that require a underlying reliable communications infrastructure. An industrial communication system is the communication required by a control plane to interact with transducers. Transducers are devices that convert electrical properties into physical properties or physical properties into electrical properties. So industrial communication is the ability for a computer in a centralized location to communicate with devices, remote switches, heat sensors, temperature sensors, torque sensors, etc., and to control them. But in order to do that, you need a communication infrastructure between the transducers and the control plane, the computer that has to manage all this processing. Industrial communication systems is usually proprietary and expensive, self-contained, and hugely not connected to the internet, and requires specialized planning and installation and training. The word IoT by definition means Internet of Things. IoT on its own is the interconnectedness of people, machines and equipment using the Internet, usually for customer applications where people are specifically involved, where the connection infrastructure is the Internet, hence Internet of Things. I believe that the benefits of industrial communication in the South African context is absolutely enormous. We need to stay competitive and therefore we need automation and very rapid communication systems to allow the interconnectedness of transducers and computers, control systems in the background. In South Africa especially, we have very sophisticated pockets of expertise that needs to control electricity, for argument's sake. The electricity distribution system in South Africa uses a control mechanism called SCADA, which is supervisory control and data acquisition. Metricom has been providing SCADA communication systems since 2004. More than half the communication that ESCOM uses to monitor and control electricity distribution in South Africa is Metacom. It is important to note that SCADA is a control mechanism primarily for utilities such as water, gas and electricity. I do believe that it is extremely relevant in the future because resources are becoming more and more scarce. Electricity, gas and water needs to be finally managed and finally controlled. And for that, we need extremely reliable SCADA communication systems to allow the SCADA system access to all remote sites reliably and efficiently in order to manage and control the distribution of a scarce resource, such as electricity. What Metricom offers is our tremendous experience building the communications infrastructure, the software, the hardware, the full integration of the systems, running some of the most extensive IoT and industrial communication systems in South Africa and certainly across Africa to connect any devices in any location to any centralized control systems. Not only have we developed expertise to provide extremely reliable connections, but we do integrate satellite fiber, GSM, short-range radio, in fact any last mile means of connection to a central control station across Africa. I believe that the future is absolutely vast for Metacom and we are especially focusing on the store of the future which will have a host of sensors in the store detecting people, shopping patterns and through processes of artificial intelligence and machine learning. It will be able to detect what the shopping patterns are and how to proactively market to certain segments of the marketplace, which is a form of SCADA. So all this reliable communication will permit our customers in the retail and financial and engineering segments using SCADA to develop smarter and smarter applications because we are able to provide them incredibly reliable and sophisticated communication infrastructure.